preseason camp for most college soccer programs is really just another way to describe summer practice on home turf. For Marquette women's soccer, camp has a more literal meaning, as in going away to summer camp. Camp Whitcomb Mason, a boys and girls club summer camp near Heartland, has been the preseason home of the program for 17 years. It looks like your typical summer camp, natural scenery, wooden buildings, and amphibians. Group bonding activities on the inside even have that camp feel. So we let seniors Emily Jacobson and Katie Hishma take us on the grand tour. This is the lobby area. This is where we hang out and watch movies. We play bags, foosball, um, we have puzzles. Come check out the thousand piece puzzles. Um, what is this puzzle? This one uh, is Austria. Yeah. This is Austria, and then this and, is. And uh, they're all made in Germany. So how many How many pieces are we worth? Thousand. It doesn't look like a thousand pieces. It, it's a thousand. So every day in between sessions, we have like two hours, two to three hours. So we'll just sit and either sleep or do a puzzle or watch There's a movie. There's movies, or... and Pitch Perfect has been yep. mm -hmm. two so far. Okay, here we go. This is the door to the acorns. We have three acorns. There's 12 girls in each acorn. Bunk bed style. Bunk bed style. Um, Straight out of summer camp. Yeah, you're gonna see. Two inch mattresses. Yep. So we've been to this camp since I was eight years old. Well, Camp Winka Mesa, I came to Wave Camp when I was here. Um, and I actually met one of my really good friends. I'm still friends with her now. She plays yeah. at UWM. And then I came here for our club. We had a overnight camp here. Um, so I did that all the way to ages 11 through 14, and then I'm back from Marquette. But there's definitely new places and new things that I've got from Camp Wickham. Like, for example, I didn't know that we had the trail, mm -hmm. that lovely trail we have here that uh, we run every morning. Mm -hmm. It's like when you do the trail, like it's, it's, it's going to look like this, Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, sometimes grassy. Like This is actually probably a pretty good, right down here, um, a pretty good look of what the trail looks like. Yep, basically. Um, and then we usually run it every morning and for time, so it's usually as fast as you can go. And then, uh, it's about yeah. Like, what, like a mile, quarter loop? Yeah, it's about like a. Yeah. Just, it's over a mile. Yeah, 1.2 miles ish. Not, so. Not all the way to one. Yeah, miles. there's a few hills in there. You hit some okay. gravel, you hit dirt, you hit wood chips. Kind of. every, so, we usually just run single file <laughs> down this boardwalk. All right, I've heard stories about people catching frogs and oh, yeah. seeing various. Oh, yeah, I've been looking frogs. right here. Meg? Oh, missed it. <laughs> joke with the freshmen tell them they have to jump in the swamp, but... Do they believe you? <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. Maybe if we actually... Actually pretend yeah. that they have to jump in it, but... No. We're nice to our freshmen. So, so it's, it's good that we're here and we're spending time together. Um, we are watching a movie or just hanging in your acorn and talking. And good, good, definitely good uh, team bonding. It's different than being on campus because when you're on campus, you can go and do your own thing. So here it's just for us, we're all together and make the most of it, it's, it's fun. If success is any indicator, this Marquette team shows the value of going away to camp.